All right, well, here we are at Tree Time Greenhouses. It's August 25th. This is the hardy pecan. It's, it's going quite well. It's growing quite nicely. Of course, I'm there with our inventory manager, uh, Caitlin. And here is how some of these are doing. Uh, you know, some of the smaller ones got a little crowded out, so we're not gonna get full cavity fill, which is a goal of ours, but this one's on the end and sometimes that happens. Uh, but you can see we're getting good height. Um, the We're probably in the 16 inch range on some of the taller ones, maybe 20 inches on the tallest of the tallest, because you can see there's a bunch in the back there that are even taller. Uh, the leaves are quite large and that's crowding out a bunch. Makes it more expensive to produce, but we've actually, we would consider this a very successful grow. Uh, this one's going to be in high demand. Sign up for your restock notifications right away. Uh, this is a, a Zone 5 uh, hardy pecan. Produces edible pecans in a northern climate. Caria illoensis. You need to check this one out. If you like nuts and you're in a Zone 5 area, you want this one. This is one of the ones that you'll, you'll really quite like. There are the occasional people that say it can grow a little colder. I haven't really experimented with it myself. Um, and it, I certainly don't think it's a warm, uh, a cold zone four. It's definitely probably more of a warm zone four. Uh, but experiment with it as you see fit and uh, give it the protection it needs and hopefully you can get it in the right way. Um, like, comment, share. Um, please uh, leave some comments, ask some questions. You know, we're out here enough that we can ask, uh, answer some questions for you if you have questions. Uh, other than that, check out treetime.ca for the latest price and availability information. Thank you very much for watching.